this fucking this one sucks. Oh yeah. Uh, so Street Fighter Five will oh, display yeah? in-game ads starting December 11th, which is tomorrow. Uh, basically, why? Uh, they're going to be so they've they've had a couple of things that they've that have become slightly more interactive. Besides these Capcom Pro Tour. They've had these Capcom Pro Tour um, 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 packs where you buy a new stage, you buy some special costumes and stuff, and then what ends up happening is you more or less fund the uh, pot and the results stage. for the p- mm-hmm. the <laughs> 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 disaster nearly averted as uh, Paige steps out with the headphones still on. Um so uh, what was happening was, yeah, you had these little things where you, you'd fund like the, the player payouts and stuff like that, community packs, and then you'd see these stages that came out that had like Evo or like the local events that were happening yeah, and, sure. and, you know, the, like reference to that stuff. So like the, the little like touching into the real world part of it or like stages that would update with graphics that were connected online were introduced via that. Okay. So now uh, Capcom says, yeah, uh, fighting game fans are used to seeing ads in tournaments, which is true. A lot of streams are sponsored by ads. So now, but now they're inf- oh, they're infiltrating the games themselves. Capcom is introducing sponsored content, the Street Fighter Five Arcade Edition, to promote purchasable bundles, costumes, and the Pro Tour. You'll see the costumes in certain stages and preload fight screens, um, and you can turn the ads off. However, if you do, you will lose extra fight money and access to sponsored material like costumes. Uh, so you can either live with the ads or accept that you won't as- unlock as much content as your ad-friendly peers. This is a pile of shit. This sucks. Uh, and here's the thing, right? I feel as if... I mean, the fact that there's a turn it off, turn it on option ma- makes me feel that... Well, one, it's nice that you can do that. But I feel like even though they're saying this is just going to be right now, they're they're talking about it being related to like Capcom bundle stuff or mm-hmm. game bundle stuff. You don't put that option on unless you're going to go outside of that. No. So the other thing is Red Bull is going to step in there. Like they got their costumes and uh, I'm sure the Red Bull would like to be able to get a more persistent per, a presence in the game. This is also being talked about and deployed alongside the game is going to be free for a week in the upcoming month, I believe. <laughs> And this feels like they are dipping their toe into what if it was ad supported free to play with microtran or whatever? Then right? you should have made it that way from the launch. But this do- this toe tipping version of it just makes the game shit. It during fucking that process. sucks because this would have been fine if you actually embraced that model and went. We want to get the most eyes on this video game as possible. And we realize that monetization is changing, so let's go that route. It's too late. And and make it free and then support it with these ads and, and these options and such. You could have gone it's that way. way too late. They now, made Street Fighter Six that had this. Or like a, a super duper Street Fighter Five that started this. Now whatever. you're fucking reintroducing it into a purchased product that we own because we've bought it. I mean, you've spent like a couple hundred bucks on this game, right? I bought a bunch of costumes. I, 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 I have, I've bought a ton of, I've supported it with a ton of packs and costumes as well, yes. And of course, remember that this is the, the, the uh, pre, prior to the game coming out, they're like, Street Fighter Five is a platform. We want this to not be constantly updated with different versions. We want it to consistently be the same one you own can be updated until you're current and you're not yeah, gonna have yeah. to go and buy new shit. So that, the noble goal of the Rock Band platform, yeah. right? If you would, once again, comes rock out. Rock Band didn't add fucking commercials in between songs, man. And it's it sounds great until it doesn't work out. And I don't know if it's just a matter of like, well, new content costs money and we don't have it coming in right now. Mm-hmm. Or if it's like, we want to test the waters of this free-to-play system or which. Yeah, but-, but you can't fuck around by taking a thing that people have already paid for and then deciding to go, oh, but some new free players will be coming in, so we can mix them in with the the mo- the same like free to play model it's it's and weird. have it be ad supported. But you're playing against people that have already paid for the game, uh, that spent money on this shit. Like, why would you cross that path? I want to ask Paige a question because she doesn't play fighting games or she barely does, right? Mm. Now, Street Fighter Five. Mm. I mean, you've been. I hope you've been paying. <laughs> well, we'll but, find out. Okay, no, but uh, so. The fact that the ads are on the fucking characters' as gloves mm-hmm. and back... That's weird, right? Like, would it not be more natural 
for there to be stages that were like fighting arenas and you had like, like in the back, ads in and the back. The, like on billboards and shit. Yeah, oh, I mean, no, no. Unless, Sorry. Oh, no, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, please. That, that's what you're saying. I don't think that's what this is going to be necessarily. The screenshot you're seeing is the cap, is the Pro Tour yeah. outfits, but that's already existing. Okay. That's like what they're describing here is a new thing oh. that I think is going to be more in the line of stages and or on the actual loading screen, a little oh, window somewhere oh, or something. That's clumsy. I that's think it's, I, I'm guessing it's going to be like that. What th- this, like these costume things are just like parts of existing costumes mm-hmm. that they've had promoting stuff. But go, go, go ahead. Well, that, that would make sense because fighters do wear sponsored, sponsored gear. gear. So, so see, that would make sense to me. That that would that would actually make a little bit of sense. If to have it was a like logo a or whatever. McDonald's. Yeah, Mc, oh, McDonald's. Why not? But or, or 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 like you know how on in baseball when you have you know on on the walls of the whatever the fuck yeah, you know see, what I'm that's saying? Yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. That, that would make sense because yeah, that's edge. how it is in real life, you know. But but to, but to have just the but, loading screen be like, are you loving it? Well, there's a there's a there's a there's a problem. Like I'm looking at the Capcom Pro Tour screenshot that you pulled up. It's got Ryu with the Capcom Pro Tour logos on his gloves. Ryu is homeless. Like. If yeah, had a lore Mc- doesn't matter in it, this con. But, lore but, doesn't matter here, like, dude. Like, it's not had about a McDonald's that. McDonald's jersey. Quite frankly, what they should have done, I would have loved that outfit way more if he was wearing a super modern MMA sponsored gear thing, mm. where it was like, "Look at this, Ryu got a sponsor." And it's just logoed out to shit. But he's still a homeless. I would have been way more on board for that. Yeah. But 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 either way, um, yeah, I don't think the screenshot is representative necessarily of what we're gonna get. I think more so, oh, it's in going that case, to be it'll probably be worse. I think it's going to be stages and loading screen like buttons and or click here to be, or That's so whatever gross. the fuck you know. That's gross. Um, and it's just a mistake, and I can't see how they're letting this go through, considering the f- and 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 you know what. I got to say that there's definitely there's definitely um, the possibility that they've been watching these streams, right? Because Capcom runs its own streams for um, Capcom Pro Tour events and, like, when you're watching Evo and stuff. And so, as soon as you get to, like, top 16, it's, it's very controlled, right? But the events themselves are often run by, like, tons of sponsors coming in. You know, Razor's got their thing and, you know, everyone's got their, like, every stream has its own sponsors. And so there's ads for, like, Monster on the screen itself, yeah. you know, and stuff. And, like, they're kind of looking at this probably going, like, well, fuck. Like, People if tolerate it here. If the stream itself has these sponsors on it, then why are we missing out on the opportunity where there's real estate, we could put these ads. Oh, I can tell you why. Because the stream is fucking free. Oh, there's that. And the ads pay for the stream, so I don't have to pay for the stream. I've bought Street Fighter Five. Unless you go eight ninety five, but yeah, that's another story. Yeah, you, you know yeah, what I mean? Yeah, yeah, right? yeah, like, yeah, yeah. I yeah. bought Street Fighter Five, yeah. and I bought costumes for it. Yeah. So why would I need to be advertised to further? Yeah. No, that's that's it's just anytime you're getting into that dicey place of. We're going to show ads to people that paid money. You're getting dicey. Like, it's just, why get that squirrely? Why not let the cost of what I purchased free me from the need to supplement with that? You know? Mm. Um, Or, I mean, if they... This opens them up to a weird argument where if they're going to use ad money to support these things and then eventually switch free to play, then, like, a, a crazy person like me would go, oh, cool, give me my money back. Hmm. Yeah, that is a weird thing, right? I, I, oh, ads pay for it now, and I have to watch the ads. So give my money back. I mean, you don't have to. You can turn them off, but, but you know what I mean. Do you have right? to pay to turn them off. No, but you get less fight money. So you'll. So get, here's what the, here's what might happen. Paid in the future. Here's what might happen, mm-hmm. though, right? Mm-hmm. If you want to have a, a a moral ground, okay. you can make it so that you don't make less fight money. You make more by turning ads on. See, that'd be smart, right? So the game stays the same, but you can go f- full on monetize shell version, the and then old, uh, you get the extras. The Warcraft rest system trick. You, are you familiar with that? No. So, uh, Paige, you ever play WoW? No. No. Okay. No, so, I'm an adult. Okay. Um, back Wrong when audience. back when <laughs> WoW was in uh, beta, uh, they instituted the rest system. Which is the way to keep people from playing fifteen hours a day right. and dying. Right. And what it what happened was is you would start at hundred percent experience, and then as you would continue uh, per kill, you would then uh, go down to ninety percent experience, and eventually you would only earn like forty or fifty percent experience. 
universally reviled by mm-hmm. the player base. Mm-hmm. Everyone hates. I don't want to stop now. So much. Oh, you're 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 punishing me for playing the game. Literally, all they did was change the numbers in the rested bar from instead of it being 100 percent and 50 percent, it's. 200 percent <laughs> yeah. and regular 100 right experience. right that's all they right, did right right and right and so it's right, like okay right. well when you're not rested you'll earn regular experience yes but when you are rested yes. you'll earn bonus experience right and that's yes, it that's yes all yes they, like, yes exactly and ff14 does that tons of memos yeah yeah that's all you do. don't punish the default add the options for for other yeah it's not yeah, a yeah, punishment yeah, yeah. it's a bonus right. it's not a bonus it's a feature you gotta mm-hmm. go to that's and you know what? Yeah, it's a perspective change, but it 100% would work. Mm-hmm. And if Capcom, like, here's the thing now, right? If this turns out to be a, okay, we will now be offering a free version of the game that's just rife with ads. With bullshit ads everywhere. But it's free. And the and the co- you can only use ad costumes and you can only play on ad stages and yeah. blah, 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 blah. But it's free. Then you're yeah sure sure yeah you're 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 throwing that out there and you're not punishing people who've already paid for their product or, right. or if you say hey if you turn the ads on you make double the fight money hey well that's a that's a thing that I would want the ads are helping me buy characters later but uh. you're not you're not decreasing the quality of the experience for mm-hmm. existing customers yeah. and that's the key this here. looks really bad so this looks really awful and I hope they take all the negative feedback they're getting for this it, it also looks like tasteless. Like just it like just not just like bad like for the game. It looks like gross for what is supposed to be the marquee fighting game, right? Yep. 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 So Capcom, that's a no no. Bad Capcom. Like Cap God, Cap God well, Gom Gom mm. Cap Cod. Capcom. Oh. You just couldn't keep the G O D, could you? <laughs> 